Australia is full of bizarre creatures. Massive snakes, flying foxes, sharks, paralysis ticks, spiders, you name it, Australia's probably got a lot of it. The country's weirdest creature, however, may have just washed ashore at Kurong National Park in South Australia. Stephen Jones, the supervisor of a cockle fishing crew, along with crew member Hunter Church, discovered an enormous sunfish, or mola mola, at the mouth of the Murray River, according to CNN. The fish was so big, in fact, that Jones's partner, Lynette Grizzlack, said Jones thought it was a piece of driftwood. Upon further inspection, they realized it was actually an animal and posed for a photo with it. Grizzlack shared it on Facebook, and the picture started gaining media attention, probably because of how truly bizarre this fish looks. None of them had seen anything like this before, Grizzlack said. They find all sorts of sea life along the beaches they dig, but it's been mostly sharks and seals. This was something very different. Per National Park South Australia, sunfish are the world's largest bony fish. They're so large, in fact, that some can weigh as much as a car. The National Park South Australia said the fish feeds mostly on jellyfish and can grow to be over two meters or more than six feet. Grizzlack told CNN Jones described the fish's skin as leathery, like a rhinoceros. This particular sunfish was only 1.8 meters long, which is small according to the South Australian Museum. Little else is known about the mola mola as they were only discovered recently. Also, if you have not done so already, Please subscribe to our channel and click that notification bell to get inspired by these real-life stories every day. Now, back to the story. The Mola Mola is known for its large size, odd, flattened body shape and fins, Ralph Foster, the museum's collection manager, told CNN. Foster added that the fish Jones discovered was identifiable by the markings on its tail and the shape of its head. He added that the sunfish's name comes from the fact that it enjoys basking in the sun. The Mola Mola's affinity for soaking up the sun's rays means they can be hit by boats. But it appears it's not so much the fish you should be worried about. Foster told CNN, some sunfish are so large they wind up sinking yachts when they're hit by them. Researchers have been putting satellite tags and data loggers on these fish and found they'll come to the surface and lay on their side on the surface, hence the name sunfish, Foster explained. Once they're warm enough, they dive down several hundreds of meters and feed on jellyfish and stay down there for lengthy periods of time. He added, we know very little about them. It's only in the last few years that technology has allowed us to start learning about them. Foster said that the Mola Mola was thought to be a purely Southern Hemisphere species. But it turns out that's not the case. One such fish recently washed up on a beach in California and was identified after a photo was shared on the Coal Oil Point Facebook page. Experts from around the world weighed in and were able to peg the strange species. The museum said there's no way of knowing why this specimen died. So little is known about these massive creatures, but at least one thing is pretty clear. They're delightfully strange even by Australia's standards. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and consider sharing it with someone who may find it interesting. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.